And I think there's something quite magical about this picture, and it's a picture that I love. Now, you can usually see this picture from some distance through a doorway, and you have this remarkable sense that you could move forward, and just for a moment, is there a corridor that you can walk into? And then you realise you're looking at the surface of a painted picture plane. There are lots and lots of clues that you can begin to interpret to work out what is going on. There is the lovely little young dog. He's not afraid of us, but he wonders who we are. And as you walk further into the room, you see this cat with her back arched, a little bit anxious. But the real action is happening in the room beyond, where you see three figures, two men and a woman, and the men are in some sort of conversation, possibly a negotiation about marriage. But at the window, there is a young man possibly just about to knock. Is he another lover? Is he just the gardener saying something more mundane? We don't know. And that's the lovely thing, I think, about Hoogstraten's work, is it creates this narrative for you to begin to ask questions. Just the whole top half is focused on a parakeet or a parrot in a birdcage and his door is open. He's free. So there's something rather lovely going on about the relationship between what's happening here at the front and what is going on in the far room that a young woman is having a contractual arrangement made about her future and she is perhaps no longer free. There's a letter just dropped on the stairs there. What can it possibly say? Well, you bend down and you have a close look. It says Samuel van Hoogstraten, 1662. It's the artist claiming the authorship of this painting. Now, Hoogstraten was an absolute master of the art of perspective, and he's really interested in deception. He's playing with us as viewers, and I think this is one of his masterpieces. You can see this picture still here at Dirham Park, where it's still amazing visitors today.